Just a quick little update on the trackpad click, trackpad click modification. I ended up ordering, this is always my preferred substance, silicone nose pads for glasses. Like I took one and I cut it. Um, I'm not going to crack this open all the way, but I took some pictures. So I'll show those right now. But yeah, it's just using a little bit of this. And I also used that, I replaced the foam that I had and I put it here. This, it's just, it's just a preference. I always prefer the silicone for the uh, padding. Let's leave that off. But really what I wanted to go over also was I was having issues with that, the click. And, well, for one, I... When I took it apart, I cleaned the dome switch, the uh, blister dome button. I'll link the guide to that just uh, with some Q-tips and rubbing alcohol. So I cleaned that button, put the silicone on top. But really, even in that video, I was stressing the, uh, the tension of the screws. And just since this was like really bugging me, and I was noticing some missed clicks. I really got in here and tested it a lot more, and it's specifically these three screws. They will have a very important impact on these clicks. And just to demonstrate, I'm almost afraid to do this just because I got it right where I want it. So, on the right pad. If I just tighten this down, there, you see that? It just registered a click. I'm stuck in the click right now. And I, it's, I didn't even over tighten it. Like it's, it could still go more. I loosen it some, loosen it. This is loosened just a little bit, but even this is like, if you wanted to adjust it, like this is, um, Boy, that is like hardly any resistance. I don't know, you can even like see how much my thumb is. That is like, ooh. I mean, that's too much for me, but if you wanted, you could really soften these up. I'm going to loosen it a little bit more. Yeah, and that's feeling good. And just, I mean, this, I kind of did the comparison before, but just so you can hear. That's, it's very quiet. Actually, I think the, I'm going to say that the silicone is the quietest of what I've tested. Make sure I got clicks here. Make sure I got clicks here. Yes. Okay. And then, yeah, like I've, I've covered these in the past, so I'm not going to go over that again, but just to make sure got that click, that click electrical tape on the bumpers that has worked very well. But yeah, mainly I just wanted to do this as a very quick little announcement, just a little PSA that I have changed it since that video from just a couple days ago. Replaced it with what's uh some silicone nose pads. You want the kind that are completely thin, completely flat. Some of them have like goofy textures, but yeah, I've found this is the best. I really what I'm actually after is just um finding what other product would this stuff come in where it's not cut. I just want a strip of this. It's like, just give me a post-it note size, you know, letter sized sheet of this silicone adhesive backed. And that'd be great. But in the meantime, eyeglass pads have worked the best. But that's that. I just wanted to do a little update. Oh, and just, I did put the, um, this is the matching button in here. It's working a lot better. And I will put links in the description to um, how the guide from where I cleaned that button. A link to these, the ones that I'm specifically using. Just remember, too, you need a 
T6 screwdriver. And okay, hopefully that is it. I'm not trying to like milk this subject, but I just wanted to do an update since I did change that and it was very recent and it's working out a lot better. And just a further reinforcement, like be very aware of the tension of those screws. And actually, just before I go, um, prior to these, the, the four that are under this, there's two over here and two down here. Those ones will also be very influential on the clicking. So like I would keep testing, making sure that it was registering before you put it all back together. And it didn't seem like these four had much to do with it. it. It's really, once I got the shell back together, these three. So, all right. That's my public service for the day. Now I can put this stinking webcam away and get back to playing something. The hell was that? I'm not even streaming. That's weird. So if I have Streamlabs running. <laughs> um, okay. So yeah, I guess that's something to be aware of. So alright, that's all I got. I will see you around.